Good evening, Troy. It's Nico from Cliff Jones, Mahindra Tractor over here in Sealy. I do apologize for the delay on the numbers. I did have an RV customer come in and I've been just totally swamped th uh, since then. I am working late tonight, so I did want to make you this video to tell you more about the Mahindra 3550. I know said that you're not partial to any brand, uh, and that's fantastic because Mahindra has a couple things to offer that other uh, manufacturers don't offer or they charge you extra for it. So this is one of my personal favorite tractors, the 3550. If you want a tractor that can lift round bales but has a smaller foot print compared to the 5555 I think this one will be the answer um, you did call on that pre-owned 4540 now just to give you an idea this is the 50 but you know size wise um, it's a little bit bigger uh, versus the 3550 so this tractor was based off the international harvester design because Mahindra partnered with them uh, back in the day so they base their chassis on the International Harvester, which is a tried and true design. This is a workhorse tractor I was telling you about that's a gear. Uh, so now, you know, when we come over here to the 3550, this footprint's a little bit smaller. I know you said you want it to be maneuverable. So this tractor will lift 2,700 pounds to full height. One thing about Mahindra, you do not have to upgrade your loader to get more lift capacity. They design each loader specifically for each tractor to maximize performance and longevity. Really great thing about our loaders is that where are they made at? Guess where on this tractor? Made in America. Not in Mexico, China, anywhere else, right here in America. So this tractor has a six foot bucket. What's really great is that our tractors come standard with a skid steer bucket. I know other brands can charge you a thousand dollars for that, but not with Mahindra. They want to offer you more value on everything that they offer. So power forks, hay spears, front postal diggers, grapples, stuff like that. If you have the plumbing for it, all you have to do is pull the two handles, the bucket comes off, and you can slap all that good stuff on there. So uh, here's the loader. It lifts 2,700 pounds to full height. We lift anywhere from three to 400 pounds more versus our competitors. So you have this pin right here. Uh, you have a kickstand that's built in. All I have to do is pull this pin, pull it out, place it right there in the middle, and a pin on the other side over here. And what you do is you put the kickstand in there, um, you pull the pins out, drop the loader, the loader races out of the saddles right here, and then you have color-coded quick disconnect hydraulics. So it takes less than 10 minutes to remove the loader if you ever wanted to. Uh, with some other brands, it's a proprietary system where you have to bring it to the dealership to have it removed, but not with Mahindra. Same thing with the bucket. We have some smaller tractors that are not skid steer. Uh, so you know your, your range of use of different implements is not as good. Um, now this is our premium tractor. So there's a couple things on this one that I really like and really appreciate. The 4500 series is a really great tractor, but um, it is just a bare bones workhorse tractor. So what you get with this one that is really one of my favorite features is how easy it is to access the engine. If you ever need to check fluids, um, if you ever need to, um, you know, get to your battery, you know, different things like that, just things that happen uh, when you own a tractor. So all you have to do is pull uh, these knobs here and get the, um, get the grill guard out of the way, and then there's a bonnet. There's a bonnet right here that you pull to access the hood, or the engine rather. So it has a pneumatic strut, it opens itself. Um, you don't need to pry it open or anything like that. And look at that, full access to the whole engine. Beautiful, with the 4500 series tractor, you know, it costs less, but really just to get to the engine, um, you really need a, a drill to undo all these screws and everything like that and to get to it. So with this one, it's just much easier. It's gonna save you a lot of time and frustration if you ever need to check your fluids, top them off, you know, test your battery, anything like that. Uh, so now the really, really big thing, and I really should have opened it with this. Oh God. That's it's a heavy hood <laughs> because we are all steel. There we go. Okay. So now I should have opened with this and I hope I haven't bored you to death, but the uh, one of the biggest things that separates us from everybody else is this sticker right here. That is a $30 million sticker. It stands for the Mahindra Common Rail Diesel. I don't know if you have a diesel truck or if you have any experience with diesel trucks, like newer diesel trucks, um, or anything with DPF or death fluid or regeneration. But about four years ago, when tractors switched from uh, Tier 3 to Tier 4, the government started cracking down on off-road vehicles and tractors just like trucks. So what most manufacturers did was slap a DPF filter on there. So whenever the light comes on uh, to do regeneration, you have to stop what you're doing, rev the tractor up all the way up to the highest RPM, wait anywhere from 15 minutes up to two hours for it to go through the process. Now, if you choose to ignore this three times, it goes into limp mode, and then you have to have the dealer come pick up your tractor. Uh, also, periodically, you have to add death fluid 
Uh, you do have to uh, change out that filter every once in a while, so that can be expensive. So, you know, Mahindra, we're very competitive on price. Uh, like I told you, until the end of the day, Saturday, we have $1,000 off any new tractor. So right now, you can get the number one selling tractor in the world for a phenomenal price. And then like I was saying uh, here a second ago when I had the hood popped, our tractors are all steel. Um, we weigh more. In some instances, on some tractors, we can weigh up to a ton more versus our competition. So I really like this tractor because it's very heavy. If you're lifting bales, it has enough weight that you don't necessarily need a counterweight. Um, so that's the great thing about Mahindra. Also, in addition to the bodies being all steel, we use cast iron rinds, not cast aluminum. A lot of brands, you know, because of globalization, um, these tractors, you know, other than huge combines, are you know generally made not in the United States. So most manufacturers want to save on shipping costs, so they use cast aluminum rear ends. They use plastic or composite materials. And let's face it, a taco truck's made out of metal. Why wouldn't you want your tractor made? Or tractor made out of metal. So. You can lift more, pull more, push more, um, more built-in weight, uh, things like that. And also with our loaders, they are tied to the rear end to give you more stability and lift capacity. Uh, if you can see this black bar right here, that goes back to the loader. Um, also, you do have a little toolbox here. So, you know, if you want to keep tools handy, um, that's nice. What's great about this tractor is you can actually uh, get on and off the tractor on both sides. With some other ones, you can only get on on one side, but with this one, you can go uh, both ways. Also, a couple of things. This tractor does have a real rear work light. So if you want to work early in the morning or late at night, you can still see what's going on with the three-point. Um, you can add a uh, seven-way plug on here if you want. Uh, that will go right here if you ever want to pull a trailer. This tractor does have a auxiliary remote. If you want to uh, put a bat wing or a rake, anything that requires one set of hydraulics, you can do that. That's about a $2,500 value. Also, what's great about this tractor is that it has category one and category two um, connections. So on some of the tractors, like the 4500 series, what you have to do is disconnect it and flip it around, but not with this one. It's nice and easy. Also, whenever you're hooking up implements by yourself, the uh, flex link ends, what you can do is just press this and, and pull it back to uh, get fine adjustments. So it's really easy to hook up implements by yourself. Uh, we do include tow bars on our tractors as well. Um, this one looks like maybe it's not on there at the moment, but we have tow bars uh, like this that come on our tractor standard. So that's about a $300 value. If you ever want to pull a trailer or a bat wing or anything like that, that does require it. So yeah, that's about it on the rear end. Um, again, this is the 3550 Power Shuttle. Uh, really, this is a premium tractor. It's very strong, very heavy. Uh, it does cost a little bit more, but you know these are the things you get with it. Uh, one of those things is going to be the weight adjustable seat. So when you're going around your property, you're not bouncing around as much. Um, it makes it that much easier. Also, what's really great about this tractor is just look at that operating platform. It's very wide open. Uh, there's nothing really there to snag your pants or your boots, anything like that. This is a great tractor. Don't get me wrong but for comparison's sake you know you got all this going on right in the middle of the floorboard so also with this one because it is it is the power shuttle uh, if you're going up to like 10 miles an hour what you can do is just slap this to forward neutral and reverse without the clutch so that's really great um, also one thing about Mahindra, we have tilt steering wheels. A lot of tractors don't, so if people of different heights are going to be using your tractor, you can raise and lower the steering wheel for a more comfortable, more comfortable ride, or even yourself, you know, if you want to change positions, you can do that. And then also, this seat does recline back as well, so you can dial in that perfect, um, perfect feel whenever you're working on your property. So, this is a loader control. I absolutely love this loader control. Honestly, some of them out there are kind of cheap, but this one's right here by the seat. You can just lean back, operate the loader nice and easy, um, things like that. Before I forget, let me close this grill guard because I don't want to bend this thing up here. There we go. All right, so, you have hand throttle. Uh, this is one part of your PTO. You have a switch for manual and auto. Um, there is also, let's see, I think it's a two-part control on this one. So you just have that switch and then you have this button right here to turn on the PTO so it's nice and easy. Um, does have turn signals, of course, and everything, and a horn as well. Uh, right over here, what's really great about this tractor, this transmission, is you have more options for ranges. So you have low, neutral, medium, high. You have first, second, third, and fourth. So you have 12 forward, 12 reverse. Um, you have controls for the three point right here, raising and lowering the three point, auxiliary remote control. You have a cup holder there so you can stay hydrated while you're working. 
You also have another cup holder over here, and what's really great is you have a place to put your phone and your belongings. That way, oh no, I dropped my wallet somewhere on my 20 acres. Where is it, right? Uh, yeah, so that's really pretty much about it on this tractor. It does have the brake right here. Uh, of course, you can take the, the switch off. If you're making a tight turn to the right, you can do that. Um, the steering, tilt steering is controlled right here. This is called the brake, clutch. Um, you have hand throttle, foot throttle next to the brake. But one thing about Mahindra tractors that I've heard a lot of people say that, you know, they chose a Mahindra. It's kind of funny, but, you know, I get it. Um, they chose our tractor because it sounds like a real tractor. It doesn't sound like a toy because a lot of other brands have, you know, all that travel for the exhaust uh, with the DPF and def fluid. They do sound muffled. Our tractor sounds like a real tractor. There you go, let me uh, get off of here so I can show you off the ground how high up it is. There you go. Pretty high up, I got it back up pretty far here. There we go. Oh yeah, and then one thing I shouldn't mention, I'm doing this totally out of order, I apologize, it's been a long day. We have the best warranty. We have a seven year powertrain, two year bumper to bumper uh, with no deductible. You don't have to purchase an extended warranty like with some of the tractors, so we're not nickel and diamond you. You have a ton of built-in value on these tractors. Also, they are assembled in Texas. I know that you're a good ways away from us, uh, but we're only about an hour away from uh, Mahindra, North America. It's on Jacker Road and 290 on the uh, northwest side of Houston. So I've been there a couple of times, it's pretty cool in the warehouse and everything but the point that I'm trying to illustrate here is that that's where the parts come from so what's really great is uh, you know some parts for different brands come from California from Georgia uh, or maybe even Dallas but what's great about our dealership is that we are a full service dealership we have an excellent service manager uh, we have a parts manager we have somebody who handles uh, warranty and also we have Miss Betty who's been here for about 30 years so generally anytime you call our dealership somebody is there to answer the phone in service uh, we've been very blessed we've been uh, growing a lot in the past couple years so we just want to make the customer experience better for everybody um, one great thing you know if we can earn your business on this tractor there's an app that you can download if you plug in 3550 um, it will show you a breakdown of the engine transmission schematics different parts that way there's no guesswork as to which parts you're ordering and our dealership has a dedicated parts driver he goes we can go there every day now because we have three different drivers if we have to uh, but anyway some dealerships wait for free shipping to send their parts out but we understand when you have a tractor you need it you need it as soon as possible if you need a filter you know stuff like that um, also you can go on our website and order parts what's really amazing you know just shows you how far customer service goes we have a gentleman that lives in California and he only wants to order parts from us because Zane is very responsive he's very knowledgeable uh, so we do have, we have a really great staff here um, I would show you around the search department but we have all the gates closed uh, we've been closed for about an hour and a half now but anyway I want to make this video for you let you know I didn't forget about you I understand I, I, I apologize, I got you know a little bit overwhelmed there here at the end of the day, but um, I wanted to make this tractor video for you, show you more about 3550, tell you a little bit about myself and this dealership. Um, so first thing tomorrow, I can get you, uh, please give me a call, my number is 979-253-2611, we can go over the numbers and everything like that. Um, so yeah, we're here uh, six days a week, every day but Sunday. Okay, Troy, again, it's Nico from Cliff Jones Mahindra Tractor over here in Sealy. Uh, thank you so much for considering us for your needs and giving us the opportunity to earn your business. If you have any questions, you can call me or text me at any time. Thank you so much. Have a great evening.